This program has some violent depictions. Parental discretion advised. Growing up, October was always my favorite time of the year. Stores put up awesome display cases. My favorite cartoons and sitcoms were putting on specials. And even though I lived in Buffalo and I had to wear my coat on the outside of my costume, I didn't care. As long as I got my candy. Halloween on the East Coast was hit or miss. It would either be beautiful out and I would flip shit, or I would just flip shit because I was stuck inside due to rain. But did that really matter? Back then, you could always find something on TV. And in between those somethings, you could find awesome commercials by like M&M's or Coors Light. It seemed like everybody was in the spirit of Halloween. But unfortunately, things and times change. So this year I decided to put together some of my favorite TV trailers, commercials, and bumpers to get you in the mood for Halloween. So in this first block of trailers you'll see a bunch of people getting like ripped through televisions, you'll see some invaders from space and some spooky stories from the hood, uh, and uh, a third movie from Tales from the Hood just dropped, just, just wanted to throw that out there. Uh, it's playing on TV, sci-fi channel topped off with what I think is the most glamorous way to present a movie trailer. The network movie premieres. <laughs> they got lights coming down the side and a big old production for these trailers. I love it. So um, sit back, enjoy these, uh, and I'll be back after the break. Hidden inside the house at 21 Shady Lane Avenue is a black and white TV with the power to turn itself on and come alive with the dead, the video dead. But for the new owners, their first warning may be too late. Why did you kill her? You don't know what you're messing with. Dead, a new form and shape for zombie terror that invades a neighborhood and threatens the innocent, the unsuspecting, and the unbelieving. Nothing can prepare you. Nothing can save you. Nothing can stop the onslaught of the video dead. It's the late show to end them all. Look what's buried inside your TV. The video dead. spirits from the dead by incantations, right? I guess. I did that by playing a record backwards. Sammy Kerr. He's a rock and roll nightmare. His fans won't let him die. He won't let them live. Trick or Treat. Rated R. Starts tomorrow at theaters everywhere. just woke up to a nightmare in his own backyard. But no one will listen. We landed right back there, right behind the hill. No one will believe.
believe. I told you, he needs psychiatric help. And soon, no one will be left. Dad? Are you okay, Dad? <laughs> Fine. Because something strange is happening to the people of Willow Creek. Everything's fine now. And David Gardner is about to find out why. David! I'm going to find my mom and dad! I think he's... No! No! David Gardner! Canon Films presents Toby Hooper's Invaders from Mars. There's no place on Earth to hide. Let's roll, bro. In this neighborhood is a house where souls never rest. You're invited to share their secrets. I've been waiting for you, boys. You're invited to share their tales. Unless, of course, you're scared. Tales of madness. <laughs> of revenge. The dolls don't want you there. They want reparation. <laughs> of horror. He thinks he needs to kill the monster. Now, your most terrifying nightmare and your most frightening reality are about to meet. On the streets. And this is a trip, homie. I don't need nothing from no house of dead folks, okay? Death. It comes in many strange packages. The producer of Menace to Society and executive producer Spike Lee will take you to the outer limits of the inner city. Tales from the Hood. Chill. Or be chilled. I mean, I don't need to be hearing this, man. Written and produced by Darren Scott. Written and directed by Rusty Kunder. It's my hand. It makes me do things I don't want it to do. Columbia Pictures presents The Touching. <gasps> Sorry about your bush. Stirring. What are you doing? CPR, man. I saw him on Baywatch. Ripping story. Okay, that wasn't my fault. Of a boy and his hand. Kinky. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, cinco, seis. Idle hands. That she wins best costume. Rated R. deepest fears are made real when the darkest nightmares come true when the most courageous soul cowers in the face of evil first time on tv the modern horror classic from john carpenter parental discretion advised this film contains elements of shock and suspense and now halloween you won't be watching it alone
tonight on the CBS Saturday Night Movies, this gentleman saved this little girl's life, but they accused him of harming her. Do this ourselves. And he was tragically murdered. Now, one by one, the men of this town are dying. Who is his avenger? Is it the dead man's grief-stricken mother? They killed my boy! The little girl who loved him. I know what you did to Baba. Or could it be the Scarecrow? Dark Knight of the Scarecrow, coming up next. The Midnight Hour rules. What a dope Halloween special that came out in November. I'm so glad they don't do that anymore. So this next block of treats is made up of TV bumpers. These are a little shorter than the traditional trailers. They're about 30 seconds in length traditionally. And um, we got some cool ones here for you. Monsters, zombies, demons, and urban legends. Stuff a couple of Reese's in your face and enjoy this next block. I'll see you after. The big green guy is back, battling the forces of evil. They call me Swamp Thing. He's got a grudge. I think that brings is good. Because they turned him to sludge. Sometimes I forget what I look like. You gotta be kidding. The return of Swamp Thing, rated PG-13. Horror has many faces. But pure evil wears only one. And this is your final chance to see it. Jason Goes to Hell, the final Friday, rated R. Starts Friday, August 13th at a theater near you. His myth has endured for years. You say his name five times, he's supposed to come. You guys don't really believe that, do you? His name has become legend. What did you see that night? He has always been a part of us. Ray's body was torn apart by something powerful. Now, he is only a whisper away. Candyman. Candyman, farewell to the flesh, rated R. Starts Friday at select theaters. There is a fate worse than death. George Romero's all-new Night of the Living Dead, rated R, starts Friday at select theaters. You don't really know much about Halloween witchcraft. The last great one took place 3,000 years ago when the hills ran red. Halloween, the dead might be looking in. Stop it. The world's going to change tonight, Doctor. Happy Halloween. Halloween 3. Season of the Witch. The Night No One Comes Home. Rated R. Now playing at a theater near you. Don't move. Don't scream. Listen. They're coming. And they can't be stopped. Because they're already dead. Zombie. We are going to eat you. Zombie starts Friday, August 22nd. as the second feature at the Lakeshore and Washington drive-ins. Something strange. Now, I didn't think much about it until I saw him drag the body out of the coffin. Something evil. Bury your own. Something terrifying is happening in Ludlow, Maine. Again. Bed Cemetery 2. No brain, no pain. <laughs> Starts Friday, August 28th at theaters everywhere. In every neighborhood, there is one house that no one will enter. Now, the director of A Nightmare on Elm Street takes you inside. Wes Craven's The People Under the Stairs, rated R, starts Friday, November 1st. From a world of fear and darkness comes a creature so monstrous, no one dares speak its name. Can't you go? 
Starts Friday, October 14th at the Showcase Cinema. Thirteen years ago, audiences across America were horrified by the brutality of a faceless killer. Now, after more than a decade of silence, he has come out of hiding. Texas Chainsaw Massacre Part 2, directed by Toby Hooper. Now playing at a theater near you. Welcome to a brand new nightmare. Time to start over again. A psychedelic nightmare. Let's trip out. A 3D nightmare. I'm not fooled by this thing you saw. The final nightmare. Freddy's Dead, the final nightmare. They saved the best for last. Rated R. Starts Friday, September 13th at a theater near you. You feeling the Halloween spirit yet? Oh, you're not into movies at all. Oh, well, no problem. Get out them TV guides, baby. You used to be able to count on the major networks like ABC, NBC, or Fox to go out of their way to make a whole night of Halloween specials, or even a whole week. I mean, they were really into it at one time. TGIF, two full hours of Halloween specials. I mean, the Sci-Fi Channel used to run 24-hour marathons of the Twilight Zone. What the hell happened to TV? Whether it was Roseanne, The Simpsons, Home Improvement, Hanging with Mr. Cooper, Full House, Perfect Strangers, they all had Halloween specials. They were all damn good. With that being said, this last block is made up of TV sitcom bumpers. Enjoy and I'll see you after. Object MBM. For three nights, Jason's on prowl. We've got to get out of here. Haunting his favorite haunts. We have to find the police. And getting into shallow short-term relationships. Okay, you big hunk of a man, come and get me. Make a date with Jason. Friday the 13th, parts 5, 7, and 8 on USA. Tonight and Thursday night at 9, Saturday night at 8. Want a timeout from Tara? Okay. Sorry, not this week. I don't know what to say. Yes, you do. <laughs> Over here. The Jason Juggernaut continues. And you're all gonna die. Friday the 13th, part 7 and 8 on USA. Tonight at 9 and Saturday night at 8. So, are you having fun yet? Crystal Lake is quiet. Oh, that's nice. Jason's in the Big Apple. There is a maniac trying to kill us. Of course, in New York, he sort of fits right in. Friday the 13th, part 8, Jason Takes Manhattan on USA. Friday night. Saturday is the start of Horror Weekend right here on Channel 20. Starting at noon, brace yourselves for the encore presentation of Fright Night. Then at 2, Tony Roberts and Tess Harper endure the wrath of Amityville 3, the demon. At 4, it's the return of Halloween 3. At 8, Sissy Spacek experiences a night to forget in Stephen King's Carrie. And finally at 10, the terror ripens as Elvira hosts the worst movie ever made, Attack of the Killer Tomatoes. Have a happy Horror Weekend starting Saturday on Channel 20. Halloween weekend on TNT's Monster Vision. Trick or treat. A joyous occasion for the whole family. Four fun-filled movies that deserve big disclaimer. Tonight at 8.30 on TNT's Monster Vision. Elvira, Mistress in the Dark, will return in a moment. Shocktober, New York's movie station creates a little monster. September, Shocktober, November. A little bite of the unexpected. What was that? <laughs> A little vampire humor? Shocktober, it's back. It's very cool to be a ghoul. We'll be seeing you. On Channel 11, Shocktober. On New York's movie station. 
Monday Fresh Prince has some special Halloween friends. There he is! Not him, his guest stars. Kadeem Hardison, Malcolm Jamal Warner, Quincy Jones, Al B. Shore, Tyler Collins, and Heavy D. Plus, Bo Jackson's cooking. When it comes to cooking, Bo don't know diddly. How hot's your Halloween? That hot, the Fresh Prince Halloween special on NBC Monday. Welcome to the Home Improvement Halloween scare <laughs> It's a full day of spooks and kooks. Get ready for a ghoulishly good time on Superstation WGN. Next at a special time, who will survive the night of the get living out. dummies? Can't we just get along? All your family matters next. Coming up next on ABC's Halloween Bash. Be on the lookout for... Is it Pirate Day again? <laughs> a spooktacular Spin City. ABC Halloween Bash, next. It's a Fox Kids Halloween. Come mighty more for every treat. Fat Man meets Wolf Man. He learns to sweep. Bobby will scare. Tash should be there. Watch if you dare. Fox Kids Halloween. Hearts to Halloween. Tonight, the Olsen Twins kick off Monster Bash Weekend. First, it's frightening good fun on Family Matters. Very funny, Bozo. Followed by Halloween hijinks on Boy Meets World. It's good to be kids. Then a home possessed on Step by Step. Boom shakalaka, boom shakalaka. And who will conjure up costumes for the kids? <laughs> on Coop, it's ABC's Monster Bash Weekend. It all starts on TGIF. Thursday, spend your Halloween with Fox and the cast of 90210. We're hosting Fox's Halloween Bash on Halloween night. We've got special episodes of The Simpsons, Drexel's Class, and my favorite 90210. And we may even throw in a few surprises. That's right, we're throwing a party and you are invited. <laughs> if you don't show up, I'll be left alone with this guy and that's kind of scary. Join us Halloween night for Fox's Halloween Bash, which reminds me, you know what costume? You'll see. Sunday, Fox presents the wildest Halloween night of all time. Guess who, fat boy? Catch two full hours of The Simpsons' most twisted tales. I've got a story so scary, you'll wet your pants. Too late. It's The Simpsons' Halloween scare -thon. Cool. Sunday, Halloween night, starting at 8, 7 central. Tonight, catch a two-hour spine-tingling special. Ah! The Simpsons' scare -thon. Hey, Jenny! And a scientific experiment turns Bud into a mutant. Where are you going? The cop would feel and kill myself. Married with children. Then grab a costume and join the party. Not the first crab I've seen in here, but certainly the biggest. The George Carlin Show. It's all part of Fox's Halloween Bash tonight starting at 7, 6 central. Elvira here. Stay tuned for more of the Fox Coors Light Halloween Bash. Thursday, it's a night of chills and thrills as Fox's Halloween Bash continues. First, get into the Halloween spirit. Hey, Martin, you dressing up? You know, I was going to go as your mother, but my hair's too long. On the scariest Martin ever. Then, you're invited to a wild Halloween party. Oh, look, it's Cher. And it's going to be a scream. This is the last time I'll let you go to the costume store without me. Living single. It's all part of Fox's Halloween Bash. Thursday, starting at 8, 7 central. Now, back to the Fox Coors Light Halloween Bash. Hi. George Carlin here, Universal Studios Florida, where they create all kinds of movie magic. This is the fly chamber. Didn't work for me. My fly's still stuck. Look at this guy. Wonder what he's screaming about. Maybe he can't find his hat. Amazing stuff, isn't it? You really gotta hand it to him. I'm sorry. Stay tuned for more of Alien Nation Dark Horizon as the Fox Halloween Bash continues. Lock the doors, bolt the windows. This Friday, Fox TV's most shocking show comes to prime time with a one-hour Halloween special. Who could ask for anything more? Tales from the Crypt. Then, some say it's an ancient legend. Each victim was ripped to shreds. But Friday... Oh, my God. The legend returns to kill the X-Files after Tales from the Crypt, part of Fox's Halloween Bash. Friday... Don't touch that dial. We'll have more of the Fox Cruise Line Halloween Bash next. Sunday, catch a two-hour spine-tingling special. Yeah. Ah! With new tricks, new treats, and new tales of horror. There's a bug that looks like Dad. Ah! The Simpsons Scarathon. Yeah, Part of Fox's Halloween Bash. Sunday, starting at 7, 6 Central. 
The Fox Halloween Bash is made possible by Universal Studios Florida. Transportation courtesy of U.S. Air, the official airline of Universal Studios Florida. Hell yeah, man. That's what I'm talking about. Well, thanks for hanging out with me for a little bit. And uh, you totally have my blessing to turn off the light, pretend you're not home, put on some awesome scary movie, and enjoy yourself. And on behalf of everyone here at Video After Death, we'd just like to take a minute and say... Yes, 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 yes